Hi guys, it's Brownie from Manhattan, New York. So I'm on my way to get something to eat, some like brunch, because right now it's Thursday and it's exactly 12:10 in the afternoon. I decided to go for a real natural makeup look. Um, I used powder foundation and then I didn't. I used powder foundation. I bronzed my face and then I highlighted and. Then I filled in my eyebrows with the Anastasia Beverly Hills chocolate eyebrow and um, my lips are like the Maybelline. It's so nice outside, guys. Can you guys see this? You guys feel the wind. This feels so good. So I um on my lips I have the 945 Stormy Sahara from Maybelline lipstick. I believe it's a matte. Um, no, it's a regular finish, a regular, um, a regular finish. I like that. Underneath it, I have on some eucalyptus, a whole lot of oil. Eucalyptus, oil, vitamin E, C, and a bunch of other stuff. Good stuff. That's nutrient to your lips and stuff like that. Chapstick underneath my lipstick. Um, for eyeliner, I have the H&M in the color gray. Um, for eyeliner and I also use it as a lower liner as well um, mascara I have on my NYC City Curling Mascara in the color 945 Extreme Black I don't know guys I've been obsessed with black eyelashes for the past like three years and then I was obsessed with black mis black eyeliner and now I'm going through this little thing where I'm obsessed with gray eyeliner. If you guys can see this, it's like it's like in between a silver and a gray. I don't know exactly what I should call it. And then I highlight with my wet and wild. And this is the Mega Glow highlighter. If you guys can see that, it's like blindly highlighting. And also on um, my nose. And my cupid spoon and my chin. But this thing is fine. I also applied some to my collarbone, my decoche. And um, I set all of this with my. I also use my NYC City Curler Eyelash Curler as well. Um, I set all of this with my e.l.f setting spray because I wanted a natural dewy look as if it's like naturally radiantly coming out of my skin. I have all my H&M sweater just tied in a boat knot. I have on my gap into a brown tank. I have on my H&M skirt, my Clark, my 14 karat white gold diamond. Again, the rain. Um, I have on my 14 karat white gold sap for uh, I said white gold. White gold, yeah, white gold sap for necklace. This is sapphires, it's not diamonds, but it looks so much like diamonds. I like it so much. Um, from Macy's and my hair, I just applied a little bit of Vaseline and then I combed it with a fine tooth comb and I brushed it with my brush. And that's how it looks. As I said, guys, I'm going for a really natural, um, everyday, casual, yet chick. Casual, so chick in my baby skirt. Cantina. <laughs> I feel so chick in my pleated skirt it's not too long. it's not too long it stops like half an inch above my knees so it's perfect for work casual day-to-day -day outings or um even church because it's the perfect length um so yeah i'm walking to my local pizza store because i'm gonna have some pizza for brunch. At first I didn't know what it was that I wanted, but I know I want pizza. So I decided
decided to take you guys along with me um, for perfume today I, I wore um, my body spray is Moonlight Pad from Bath and Body Works and then my Chloe Love, Love Story then I have my Chloe Love Story perfume and I have on the Victoria's Secret Shimmery Body Cream lotion I have on the Olay Regenerous um, Tone 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 Correcting All Day All Day for lotion for facial facial lotion that's the facial lotion and I have on some Johnson Johnson body powder, Johnson Johnson baby body powder like um on my other arm before I use my different Like the gel, the gel, the gel, the gel, and I have my teeth, and so okay, 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 and okay, I have a toothbrush, guys, with the teeth. So good. So I like the toothbrush with the ridges on the other side. It has a section that's made for it has a section that's made for brushing your tongue on the other side of the toothbrush. So it has the first part, which is the regular toothbrush, and then and then on the other side, then on the other side it has the part that's for brushing your tongue and it just makes your mouth feel so much more cleaner once you use that I actually use it to brush the rigid side I've not used a regular toothbrush to brush my tongue and the bottom of my tongue and I use the rigid side to brush the top of my tongue and the bottom of my tongue and it just makes my mouth feel so much more cleaner so much more refreshed um, lately I've been and then I wash my mouth out with either hydro peroxide or mouthwash because as you guys know I just did my tongue piercing and it takes it takes six months to completely fully heal but it takes it takes six months to completely fully heal but with after four weeks it's healed so you can change your ring and stuff like that as I did so this is a church this is a library guys this is a library see how close it is to me it's literally five minutes away that is the harlem library and this is the church of scientology and it's huge they literally have two two um two churches um and then i also have an antique store so if you guys can see this is an antique store by me they call it the demolition but all they sell is antique pieces everything in here is antique and i don't know if you guys saw the gas station i don't know if you guys saw the gas station back there there's the gas station on the corner back there and then you have um goodyear over there a car car fixing a car fixing place um and it has like a really and this is like a mini car they usually have the doors open where you could go in and sit down and it's just benches and stuff and it's like a real zen okay. and this used to be perkins restaurant if you guys have any perkins next to you know it's like a um, a, it's a diner, um, but they move, and yeah, like this neighborhood is pretty cool to live in. Um, you know, it has a lot of attractions that makes it very popular. I like 
a lot of factories that makes it very, very popular. And yeah. So they're fixing something over there. You guys can see. They're fixing something in the ground. And it is very sunny outside. And it's beautiful. so nice on my skin anytime I walk some place that has a lot of sun and then over here they have a sleepies if you guys can see the sleepies for some reason sleepies have been changing their name to mattress firm but it's actually sleepies if you guys can see that it either says mattress firm or sleepies, then they have a pet land, then they have a foot action, and then they have a, um, a GNC over there, the other area from where um, you guys can see. Then they have a GNC, then they have, after the GNC, they have a DMV over there. Those drivers out there. They need to know about the Wait, no. It's GNC, then they have a bank. Wait. I'm sorry, guys. So they have GNC, and then, yeah. They have GNC, and then they have DMV. So you guys can see. That's the GNC, and then that's the DMV. And then they have Bank of America and Shielders Place and Payless. And then on the corner they have McDonald's. So that's a DMV up there if you guys can see it. it has two floors. That's a DMV. You guys can see. See. That's a DMV right there. Um, if you're like me you don't have your license. That's some place you need to be getting your stuff to study to get your license from that way you could drive all over I drive guys but I don't have my license so I do drive and then we have so yeah so this is like a pretty cool place um, be because it has a lot a lot of attractions it has a lot of attractions this is the bus if you're going to LaGuardia Airport the 60 bus and it goes straight to the airport and it's express from here it's two stops we're now on 125th in Lexington and from here it's two stops and then you'll be in Queens so if you want to just like get out and just go somewhere you know that's like totally perfect and then you have a Dwayne and Reed over there and then a newly built model and then across the street they have IHOP if you guys can see that they have IHOP over there and then directly this way, over here they have, um, directly this way, they have Subway, Golden Crust, Baskin Robbins, phone stores. So it's a lot of places. Sometimes it's so hard to choose what you want to eat because there's so many places to go eat. So it's like confusing. Like, where do I want to go eat? Oh man, all these places to go eat. Oh boy. Yeah, so I'm gonna grab some kind of drink store. Um, it's a local deli store. So I'm gonna grab something to drink. I'm gonna grab something to drink there. And <laughs> Thank you.
So, um, grabbing a cola and um, grabbing something to drink and I'm about to, um, so I'm about to, I'm just grabbing something to drink to get out of the store. Thank you. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah, I, I just stopped to grab something to drink. And now I am. So, yeah, so I grabbed something to drink. I wanted a certain soda that I don't think most stores have. Um, in New York, they have 50 cent sodas. I don't know if you guys know about this, but this is like a really awesome thing about living in the urban community. Um, well, not so really. The urban community, but the urban community, you know. Um, so this is, uh, this is, I thought it was a cherry cola. I wanted cherry cola, guys, because I've been craving cherry cola, but I picked up regular like coca-cola it tastes like coca-cola more than it does pepsi so for those of you guys who aren't like who don't drink these sodas to know the difference like there is a specific taste for cola and a specific taste of pepsi so i went and picked up a um uh cola tasting soda and i'm gonna grab some pizzas i told you guys so there's a church here that's a church and that's a pizza store so i'm gonna be grabbing some pizza i'm gonna be grabbing some pizza cactus slices okay um, so yeah, I'm grabbing some pizza and I got my cola mm -hmm. I'm super excited now I'm super excited now For my pizza and cola You guys see the pizza is so delicious They made in the oven and Oh, and then they have the cheese slices over here and all different types of pizzas. But I just grabbed two plain pizzas because I'm going to be full afterwards. So I just grabbed two plain slices. And yeah, thank you. <laughs> So I got my pizza. I'm gonna put some pepper. Um, some garlic. Some oregano. Um, and some black pepper. They used to have parmesan here, but they don't have it no more. And some black pepper. And some black pepper. Um, my pizza. But I'm eating because that's what I'm craving pizza. I woke up thinking about pizza. So that's what I'm eating. So don't do this video, share it, like it, subscribe with me. Oh, now I'm just gonna continue going. So I'm about to the pizza just came out, so it's hot. It's literally hot. So uh,
Come to this video, share it, like it, subscribe to my channel, stay there, me and my life. You guys will do the same. If you guys want to see more mini vlogs like this, let me know in the comment section below. Again, this is Bonnie from Manhattan, New York. Mwah! <laughs>